In the 1960s, University of Southern California professor of education, Lawrence J. Peter, made some astute observations that held up to widespread scrutiny. It resulted in the best-selling book published in 1969 entitled The Peter Principle. The Peter Principle states that a person who is competent at their job will earn a promotion to a position that requires different skills. If the promoted person lacks the skills required for the new role, they will be incompetent at the new level and will not be promoted again. If the person is competent in the new role, they will be promoted again and will continue to be promoted until reaching a level at which they are incompetent. Being incompetent, the individual will not qualify for promotion again and so will remain stuck at this final placement, or Peter's Plateau. The corollary to the Peter Principle is the Dunning-Kruger effect. An academic paper describing it was published in 1999. The Dunning-Kruger effect is a cognitive bias whereby people with low ability expertise or experience regarding a type of task or area of knowledge tended to overestimate their ability or knowledge. Some researchers also include the opposite effect for high performance, their tendency to underestimate their skills. Interestingly, really smart people also fail to accurately self-assess their abilities as much as D and F grade students overestimate their abilities, A grade students underestimate theirs. In their classic study, Dunning and Kruger found that high performing students whose cognitive scores were in the top quartile underestimated their relative competence. These students presumed that if cognitive tasks were easy for them, then they must be just as easy or even easier for everyone else. This so-called imposter syndrome can be likened to the inverse of the Dunning-Kruger effect, whereby high achievers fail to recognize their talents and think that others are equally competent. The difference is that competent people can and do adjust their self-assessment given appropriate feedback while incompetent individuals cannot. This should shed some light on why nothing works properly and everything is so screwed up. Charles Darwin wrote in The Descent of Man, 1871, Ignorance more frequently begets confidence than does knowledge.